this the root? Has anybody, to be honest, ever taken blogto.com seriously on most of its news articles? Seriously, has anyone ever taken them factually seriously? Noting also the fact that they only and mostly use social media as resources and like most fringe blogs and that, confirm, or sorry, refer to their own articles as legitimate sources. Have you ever noticed that at all? I have. I don't know why they use their own posts as legitimate sources for all their articles. Now, if I was doing news and journalism, I wouldn't be doing that. You know that. I would never ever do that because it is, it makes, it more or less breaks a cardinal rule in terms of uh, being credible and uh, trying to, in most cases, blame the victim is also what they're doing. Also breaks that cardinal rule also, pretty much and it's, it's not good. It's not good at all. I see most of the articles they write, they use a template, a lot of templates to be honest, probably about 10 to 15, and their quality of journalism, because I'm very critical on that, is about the ranks of dropout students. I'm not saying what kind of school they were from, but dropouts. <coughs> and uh, they kind of have an agenda. Fly, let me try and catch it. it got away away fucking thing yeah so I can't really take them seriously I can't I'm, I'm sorry the only the only good thing their journalism actually well their blogging has actually gotten about is uh talking about restaurants that's okay they're good at that however sometimes they kind of hype up the uh how good a restaurant is or how bad a restaurant is the other part, sorry, part, why am I saying part, is uh, uh, they tend to favor certain kind of restaurants. And what I've also noticed is sometimes their posts aren't even factual at all. Say in a restaurant or business is closed when they've never closed at all. I've gone past those restaurants. At one point I asked one of the owners and they says, what are you talking about? We're not even closing anytime soon. And I showed them the article. And... Uh, <laughs> It wasn't too, I, I'm not going to say the details on that, but they weren't too happy to say the least. So, they try and sway people's opinions on restaurants and that. Or on anything for that matter. And, uh, no, I, I, can't, I can't use them as an official news source. I would more or less trust uh, main and minor stream media that's not fringe. That's not from fringe groups. That doesn't quote its own sources. But at least links back and yeah if you're gonna cite any sources it's probably best to actually uh, make sure they're verified and don't use social media because uh, they also kind of steal yes they do actually steal people's videos and repost them on social media often not giving anyone credit and a screenshot is not fucking credit no it's not if you could link directly to that tweet, that post, that's, that, that's still not credible. And they don't even reach out to the people when they uh, make the blog posts either. That's what media does. They actually reach out to them. They lack that quality completely. Anyways, I just thought I'd mention that. If I've gone a bit harsh, I don't care. I'm a nobody. But I'm sure there's others that actually do journalism for their school, university, whatever, that actually make sure they cite the correct sources and verify them. Anyways, that's all I'd rather say. I gotta get to work. Peace out.